And hello everyone, it is Peter Sam, the Narrow Gauge Engine here for my annual update video. I did a video like this last year and I'm going to continue the trend. This is because A, I'm a sucker for series, and B, I do actually have quite a lot to share and quite a lot I'm looking forward to as the year begins. I think 2023 is going to be a big year for the channel and whilst 2022 was quite groundbreaking with the re-ranks that actually have rankings that align with fair criticism and a series that a lot of people love and that have given me some good friends within the community in locomotives i'm hoping this year will be one of my best and i'm predicting that this year will be that for me but before i speak about anything i should probably mention something which marks the end of this year earlier this year a great guy who i have come to know and someone who i have idolized for the longest time rob the green engine has announced that at the end of the year he'd be leaving the platform and stop producing content <laughs> No matter, I shall delay you no more, and I hope you will come to look forward to what I have in store because oh boy, it's great. Let's start with the series that you all enjoy the most, as proven by the community poll I sent out a month ago. Ah yes, the ranking videos. What a fun time it was to watch the premieres of these bad boys and have you all give your opinions on them. I always enjoyed the fourth of every month in the past year, no matter which season I was discussing. So that's what a large majority of the first half of the year will be dedicated to, these kinds of videos. The first of these videos will be helping to wrap up our journey of the previous year, as I shall be ranking every model era season from worst to best. As per, you shall be expecting this video on the 4th of January, so quite soon really. But you may be asking, what is next for the ranking videos? Well, there's one error, a very interesting error, and one that many have a fondness for, that I haven't touched on at all yet because of my model error bias. The Brenner error. Yes, that is right, next year I shall be looking at seasons 17 to 21 and ranking all of their episodes and ranking those seasons themselves at the end. You can expect these videos on the 15th of every month from January to June. Season 17 in January, season 18 in February, etc. and until June, where we shall be ranking the seasons themselves. It's going to be great fun, because I think where the Brenner era is concerned, what is good and what is bad is a lot more grey and blurred in contrast to something like season 4, where the general consensus of what is good and bad is widely accepted. So yes, that is the first thing on my list of many, but we've still got so much left to talk about. Let's move on to the other main series from 2022, Locomotives. Locomotives has had a lot of significance for me as a content creator over the past year. I feel like I've done one of these series where you're telling a story justice for once. Don't look at the other failures of stories I've told before now, just this series please. So as the one successful series I've had, I'm going to fucking milk it because I'm an asshole. In between ranking videos, I may be putting up little compilation videos as a part of Locomotive Extras. Just because I think looking back upon the series will be nice and doing like a Crashes compilation and a Deaths compilation compilation really brings back those memories of all the fun I and a lot of others out there had with this because it was really something everyone who worked on this was passionate about. Never before has a Thomas and Friends fan series taken on this sort of soap opera style where you have multiple ongoing stories at once throughout the episodes and that's one of my favourite things about it. So we have some compilation videos. What else is there Peter Sam? Thanks for asking Peter Sam. We have the official Locomotives Season 1 soundtrack being released at some point in the first half of the year too, with all of the songs from the season. Not only that, but we also have a very special kind of video called My Opinions on Locomotives, coming out around the same time, where I discuss my thoughts on the series as a whole, stuff I liked, stuff I didn't, what I'd go back on if I had the chance, and of course this will take form of a ranking, because it's not Peter Sam approved if it's not been ranked. Hopefully I can get some opinions from my VAs on this, and hopefully you fuckers if you're up for it. Expect it in the first half of 2023, alongside the ranking. Kings. And if you haven't watched Locomotives already, please go and watch it. I'd say the only flaw is the map I use belongs to a twat face, and that's it really. But yeah, check it out. It improves over time. I strongly recommend it. Now onto the last little thing about the series I have to mention before moving on to other stuff. You'll have noticed that the second half of 2023 seems quite barren at the moment. 
quite desolate and bleak. Well, that's because from July to December, the main ongoing series shall be season two of Locomotives. We have new plots, new characters, and a lot more excitement. Where season one would have some filler episodes like Drought that don't have any ongoing shit to deal with, season two takes on a lot of ongoing stuff happening within the episodes. But just be aware that a little jet black diesel will be arriving on Sodor and he's quite the troublemaker. That's all I'll reveal for now, but rest assured there will be more updates as we get closer to the first episode on July 2nd, 2023. Now I'm sure many of you are sick to death about this now, and you want something a little more your taste, and revolves around the actual show and all of the stuff around it. Well, do I have a treat for you? Yeah, you read the title. I am so excited for this one. I've always wanted to speak about these feature length films for as long as I've been on the platform, but only now have I decided to do it. Why? Because my scheduling allows it. This will be the first of many long form videos that I hope to make on the channel, and boy oh boy am I thrilled it's gonna be this one. The films were always a big part of Thomas and Friends, and in my opinion, sometimes superseded the show. You couldn't always fit a giant exciting plot, like exploring a secret island or whatever the fuck Tatmo was trying to do into a 4 minute, 6 minute or 10 minute episode. That's what made the films so important to me, even ones I hadn't watched before, because you could afford to do those grand stories. However, despite all that, I will only be talking about films from Tatma to JBS, as I'm not brave enough to look at Wubba, and certainly not Dancing Robots. But I'm sure you wouldn't want me rambling on about why Wubba sucks or why Dancing Robots are weird. Regardless, this video will be coming out around the start of 2023 hopefully. I'm thinking February or March time, but it will be somewhere in the first half, along with the Brenner seasons. Now onto the next thing, the biggest video of the year in every sense. Coming to you all in the second half of 2023 will be every Railway Series story ranked. This was inspired and came about from a few different things. The first thing is obviously the Unlucky Tugs video on the books where he ranks them all, which I shall be one-upping because I feel like I have a lot to say and I want to be more in-depth. The other thing was my old series, Rating the Railway Series, which is, um, how do I say this? bad. I had clear opinions but no script and there was barely any editing. It was essentially fucking lazy. Plus, as we've learned with the series rankings, my opinions are subject to change. If you want to check out that series, there's a playlist on my channel. I only did the original 26 books then, and I did plan for me to do the Chris Audrey stuff later on, but never got round to it because of locomotives. This video will be looking at every single story, so both Audrey's, but only official railway series titles. No Thomas and the Evil Diesel, or whatever. This will be my longest video yet, as I will have a lot to cover, but I'm confident I can do it. I reckon I will get the video done around September to October time, but it may be longer. I wanted to give you all something during Locomotives, so that those of you that like the ranking videos wouldn't be void of any other kind of content. However, it's not just this video that will be filling that hole for them. I have one final trick up my sleeve, one last video that you will get for the end of the year, for you rankings fans amongst my subs and that is Tugs was a series that used to be requested for me to rank a lot, and I have watched bits and pieces in the past, but never the full thing. 2023 will be when this changes, as a full ranking video will be released in December alongside Locomotives, ranking all of the episodes from worst to best. Tugs is something that does interest me. Maybe not as much as Thomas, but I do think there are good stories in there that are worth praising, and a lot of cool set design with such intriguing and dimensional characters filling out the cast. I think only 13 episodes of the series exist, which makes being able to watch this series in full a real treat, especially since this was made in the 
80s. So I hope that that video provides a satisfying end to the year and that the rest of the year you shall be looking forward to as well. And that's it. 2023 is going to be a wild ride with so much stuff to do. So I'll be working my ass off trying to get shit done. And I hope that what I get done will be entertaining, fun and true to the Peter Sam you will know and love. By the way, if you are new around here or if you just haven't clicked the subscribe button yet, go ahead, help an engine out. It's there if you want to and I would really appreciate it. So with everything addressed, I've been Peter Sam, you've been you and I have a lot of filming to get done for fun. Fuck's sake. Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Fuck yeah, sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. Woo, yeah! <laughs> You're right, yeah!